Alright, uh, let's clear S and 10 with the Noel squad. First of all, I will immediately say this. If you don't have someone really strong uh, with the... Uh, or you have true damage, uh, so Kalsit, um, uh, yeah, Kalsit. Uh, or you have someone like Fartutu to ignore enemies to physical dodge, uh, or like Gnosis. Uh, Lapland uh, to silence enemies, just uh, don't even think to auto deploy this stage. Because that will be impossible due to the enemy's dodge. Really annoying. So even if you can clear the auto deploy, but uh, no, even if you can clear the stage, but when you do the auto deploy, if that enemy manages to dodge one time, then entire timeline will get fucked up because the skill activation, the timing, everything will change. Enemies will survive, etc., and you will just uh, be impossible to auto deploy. So this stage is really, really not supposed to be auto deployed by newbies. Um, yeah, just to clear it once to take the reward. And then uh, that's it, basically. Uh, anyways, for this stage we will, need, we will need the second part of the little hand as well. How to little handy? How to get the second part? You need to form the first map. So under the SN5, this one. After you collect 500 event currency, you can get it. So that's uh, yeah, just need that. If you have the third and the fourth part, uh, even better. But if you don't have, it's fine. Just just those two. Remember on the left side, huh? Those those two on the left side. Then the squad is like this, with a core operator charter from the support unit, if you don't have your own. Then, uh, yeah, so Myrtle, uh, Flag Vanguard, Single Block Vanguard, Traditional Vanguard, your best caster, your best sniper, your best AoE guard, your best ranger guard without damage, your best medic, another best medic, medic defender, and another good defender. That's all we need. Let's do this. Let's just clear it. So, immediately, Flag Vanguard here to get DP. Then deploy your single block vanguard to kill the first phase boss and some enemies from the upside. And just get DP here. If you can manage to deploy the AoE guard already now to block enemies, good. If you cannot, then just deploy the uh, how to say, vanguard here. And then deploy the AoE guard. I'll just wait for DP. And you should be able to deploy the defender in time here. If you cannot, then just retreat this single block vanguard when uh, it kills this one. But uh, if you can, just do this. Now, wait for DP. Deploy the caster here to charge the skill. Now you can retreat around the 7, the single block vanguard, there are no more enemies here. Prepare a sniper here face on top side. Prepare um, your best medic here face on top side. Now keep waiting for DP. And then we deploy our beautiful Chen here face on bottom side. That's all we need. Now, I don't know if you already understood how the boss works. Basically, those enemies with the thingy, the symbol on their head, means when they die, they will release, drop a relic. The boss will eat uh, one of the relic. How the boss choose? Basically, the boss will choose the most near to him. So basically, if you kill this one here and then kill this one here, the boss will eat this one. And we don't need, we don't want this to happen. Because if the boss eat this one, when the boss HP is uh, low, it will increase the defense a lot. And with the channel we cannot kill anymore. Unless you have like a Surtur here in the squad to kill the boss second phase. Then you can just kill this one here. That's why we need to reduce its HP to really low but not the killing. Well this one we can just kill. If the boss eats this one, we'll just increase the resistance. And that's a good since we are using physical damage to kill. Now left side, middle, let the AoE guard kill. If you can manage to kill all of them from the spawn, nice. Because when those enemies die, they will drop the mud. But if it's on the special tile, they will not drop. Okay? But uh, yeah, our guard, the guard is too weak, so we cannot kill off them. But uh, few is possible. Okay, here, as you can see, the HP is really low, right? Just retreat now. This one kid, you can retreat the sniper. And just retreat the, yeah, the AoE guard. Okay, let those come and just use a chain to kill. Now, how to manage here? When this... Uh, enemy with this thingy here in the middle of those two ties, activate the chance kill. With this timing, we can kill those basically together and we can clear the mud. Also, you play a medic hero face on right side to kill. Okay, you can see those dead. One more hit, one more hit Jen, and then deactivate the skill and use the device face on downside to clear the mud before they can spread. On top side, don't clear yet, because even if we clear, this one will spawn, keep spawn. This enemy can be only blocked by operators with two or more attacks when, the, when they have the shield, so be careful. 
Just. Uh, that's why. Now, if the boss, if the enemy dies here, the boss will eat this one instead of this one, because this one is more, the most near. So just deploy a double block operator to block and a caster to kill it. If you killed, you can just retreat. Retreat those uh, operators and let the enemies come. As you can see, the boss will do this one. That's what we want. Okay, perfect. Okay, prepare a sniper here face on top side. Oh, also use the device to clear the mud on top side. Just like this. Okay. Bottom side, you don't need to use the um, chain skill yet. Just wait a bit. Around uh, now, when uh, this uh, Vanguard gets stunned, just use it. The boss will also come. Give this Vanguard here. After the boss change the target from this Vanguard into this defender, also the deploy a Hustle here on top side. Okay. You can see now we'll change it because yeah, we deploy that one later. Wait to the boss. Yeah, just let the boss keep hit this one. Okay. And when the boss dies. Okay, defender here. First phase done. The boss has a four phase. No, second phase done. The boss has four phases. So now prepare. Um, now range the guard here, face on right side as well. You can get a DP and then uh, retreat this vanguard to deploy a. to redeploy your AoE guard here in the middle. Now, during the second phase, you can just let the boss eat buff. It's not a big problem because Chen can kill or deactivate the skill to charge it. Yeah, and the second. No, this second phase, no, third phase, oh my god, so, so, so confusing. Third phase, basically when you see this big mouth enemy and this uh, mushroom, just to kill them together, let the, the boss eat together, it's fine. No need to worry. Also in the middle, we need to block a bit because they have too much dodge. If they stacks up here and the chain cannot hit, hit kill because they keep dodging, they will leak. So block a few of them. Create the skill to help kill this one faster. When that one dies, you can retreat the Ranged the guard, you can retreat this one, you can retreat the caster. Keep the AoE guard here until she gets stunned. Okay, then you retreat. Bottom side, just wait to chance kill. And when chance kill is ready, just activate it to kill. It's better if from the last slot you bring an extra defender. Hmm? Okay, perfect. One more hit. Nice, deactivate it, because those enemies will dodge, right? So we can just use the, this dodge um, to let the Chen charge a bit the skill. Keep dodge, keep dodge. Yeah, even if the enemies cannot dodge a lot, it's fine. Because the third, the third and the fourth phase boss is really, really weak, as you can see. Just activated the skill here, and the boss cannot really do a lot of damage. Now, on the 40 enemies, on this amount of count, Deep, prepare your caster here face on right side. Prepare your sniper here face on, uh, uh, sorry, face on uh, left side. Prepare your ranged guard here face on right side. And uh, just wait. Deploy a vanguard here to get DP. We need the chance kill ready for around this time. So he's ready to kill this one. Just in time, activate it. Boom. Okay. Hope the boss will dodge a bit. Nice. Kill this mushroom. Then we can just... Oh, one more hit from Chen. One more hit from Chen. Reduce the HP a bit more. Okay. One more hit, maybe. Oh, come on, Chen. Hit it. Ah. Oh my god. Okay. Deactivate it. And just let the Chen charge the skill while the boss is dodging. You get DP. Actually, you can retreat. And deploy your... And we guard here as last operator, remember, last operator. Now just to wait. We can retreat this um, AOE medic, uh, medic defender as well. So at least we can restore the... How is it called? Restore the corrosion damage. As you can see, the dodge is really annoying this stage, huh? For example, if during this clear, I kill the boss because the boss didn't dodge, so I deactivated the skill, then I activate it uh, later. But during the auto deploy, the, do the boss dodges like uh, 10 times. The timing of me clicking on the skill is still the same. But the boss reviving HP is different. That will make you lose. That's why if you cannot make uh, stable, so making the dodge uh, uh, silen silencing enemies um, or crowd controlling enemies uh, is not really good to auto deploy this stage. Okay, perfect. 
Last uh, wave, be careful. In the middle, no topside, just kill uh, those, really simple. Activate the uh, burst medic skill, activate this one skill. In the middle, you have uh, still four devices. You need to keep one for topside, one for later. So the other two, you can use it on the middle to save your operators. How to use them? Wait when there are two of those enemies spawning. Okay, for example now, just use it. At least they will not damage too much your operators. Now, when this enemy is in range, activate range card skill. Okay, two of them spawn, so just stun. Here we go. All four killed in the middle, so you can retreat the AoE guard. You can retreat the sniper as well. Caster skill to help kill this enemy. Bottom side, activate chain skill to kill this enemy. Deploy um, defensive vanguard here. Top side, you... You, we don't want the boss to eat buff this time. We, we, need, we, want, we, want, mm, we want the boss to eat the other one we already killed. While this one, if the boss eats this one, is the end. Unless you can one-shot the boss. Because if the boss eats this one, the boss, more the boss attacks the same target, uh, the, the higher will be at, the attack. Unless you restart, restore the attack uh, interval. So we need to let this enemy go here and use the device to kill it. The device has 2000 of attack, so reduce the enemy to around this amount of HP. Really low HP. Well, the bottom side just kill it with Chen and keep the skill on to kill the boss later. Top side just keep going. One more hit. Okay, retreat the caster. Retreat this one as well. This amount is fine. The, this thing you can one shot. The weight is not on. Near to this one, okay, a bit more, around, the... now kill it. Okay, nice. Alright, everything good. Uh, here we treated the medic as well, this wave, just let them go. You can see there was only eight, eight that one. We needed to kill the boss as fast as possible, because we need to, yeah, before those enemies with the dodge comes, so at least we can block. Else will be a problem, but we still have this one, this one can still damage them, a lot. So go, go, Chen, kill. Those you can see really, really slow. You can kill them really easy too. Okay, the boss is dead, so just let those enemies come. Uh, maybe better if you deactivate the chance skill. Okay. Here use uh, sniper face on top side to help kill this. Uh, use a single block vanguard to help block a bit. You can retreat this um, uh, vanguard, you don't need it anymore. Come on. Okay, good job. This one is coming. If they manage to reduce this uh, corrosion damage to zero, so they will be stunned and so enemies so will go through, you can just uh, do this. Replace uh, with the other defender we retreated before. That's uh, what uh, I wanted to do. Okay, perfect. This is sniper killed. Now another medic here. Yeah, operator. Yeah, just do whatever you want. Just a few HP. Machine kill. Here we go. Really, really not simple and not uh, just don't auto deploy this if you're <laughs> not if you're a newbie. This stage is really, really hard to auto deploy. Believe me, don't even try. Anyways, that's it. Hope this video helped you. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next video. Bye.